everybody. Welcome to Sir Chuba's Accounting Lessons PH. This is our orientation for the Fundamentals of Accountancy, Business and Management Part 1. Actually, this subject, FABM1, is made for grade 11. Okay, so basically, uh, grade 11 students are the one who's having this subject, okay? However, uh, what we will be talking about in FABM1 is basic accounting, okay? The fundamental principles of accounting, the basic accounting process, and how it is being applied in a business entity under the sole proprietorship type of business. So, if you are also a first-year BS Accountancy student, or you are in the other accounting programs like management accounting or internal auditing or accounting information system, then your first year and you have a basic accounting subject, this will also be very helpful for you. Or if you are a business uh, program student like business administration, customs, tourism, HRM, and uh, uh, depending on the curriculum of your school, you also have a subject for basic accounting, then this will be also helpful for you because we will be talking, what we will be talking here is basic accounting, okay? But this is primarily made for grade 11 students, okay? But anyone, actually this video is for everyone, so if, uh, if you want to learn the basics of accounting, then this will be very, very helpful for you, okay? So this is our subject orientation for FABM1. Allow me to uh, give to you the outline of the uh, topics that we will be having for this specific subject. So our videos in this tutorial will be step by step from 1 up to 21. Okay, so first thing that we will do is I will introduce to you what accounting is. So we will have the definition, uh, what are the functions of accounting in business. We will also be talking about the history of accounting and uh, why do we do accounting in the first place okay so the the first lesson will involve a very introduct uh, very introductory theme uh, lesson for accounting okay then the second uh, topic would be the branches of accounting so uh, there are uh, different branches of accounting that we need to know like financial accounting management accounting or cost accounting so how do each of those branches function Okay, then we will also be talking about the users of accounting information. Okay, so just to preempt, we have two users. We have the external users of accounting information and we also have the internal users of accounting information. So we will be tackling them in detail in this video. Okay, in, uh, in the video for number three. And then we also have the different forms of business organization. So just to uh, give you an overview, the three, uh, the four, sorry, the four forms of business organization include sole proprietorship. Then we also have partnership, corporation, and cooperative. Okay. We will also be talking about the activities of these business organizations, okay? So these business organizations can enter into a service type of business or merchandising or manufacturing, okay? And then we will also be talking about accounting concepts and principles that we usually use. And this will also include the generally accepted accounting principles or the GAAP. Okay. And then the accounting equation. So just to give you an idea, the accounting equation is asset is equals to liabilities plus capital. So how will we analyze this equation and apply it in accounting? Okay. And then we will also be talking about the types of major accounts or the elements of financial statements, which includes your assets, liabilities, capital, revenue, and expenses. And then the two books of accounts, which is the general journal and the general ledger. We'll also be talking about the books of accounts that accountants use to perform the whole accounting process. 
we'll also be talking about the rules of debit and credit. So, maririnig nyo na yung word na debit and credit. So, take note of this. Debit and credit. Okay? So, just to give you, again, an overview. Let's say, for example, this is an account. This is what you call a T account. Okay? This is an account. The left side of the account is called the debit side. And then the right side of an account is called the credit side. So, this is left, this is right. Okay? So, we'll be talking about the rules of debit and credit uh, in the video for number 10. Okay? And then, um, coming from 11 up to 18, so from 11 to 18, these 11 to 18 is the whole accounting process, okay? So after you have understood all of these things, it's time for you to perform the accounting process, okay? So you start the journalizing or the recording process and then posting and trial balance, classification and summarization of accounts, and then adjusting entries, worksheets, preparation of financial statements, closing procedures, and reversing entries. Okay, so we will be performing the whole accounting process, but uh, we will only focus in this tutorial in a sole proprietorship type of business. So when you say a sole proprietorship type of business, only one person owns the business. And then for this specific accounting process, we will be tackling about service industries. Okay? So later na tayo sa merchandising at manufacturing. Okay? And then after you have already known, and, uh, after, after you have learned the accounting process for service companies, it's time for you to know merchandising. Okay? And then we will also be talking about the income statement under merchandising operations and special journals and subsidiary ledgers. So um, we will formally start the lessons at the next video because the next video will be talking about this one. Okay, so the next video will be talking about this one and uh, before you watch the next video, I highly suggest that you read some terminologies first of accounting so that it will be easy for you to grasp the terminologies that we'll be tackling in this uh, video tutorial. Okay, so also in the, the whole lessons that we will be tackling in uh, the succeeding videos, uh, I also have a website which will be given at the description box and uh, uh, in that website, I will put all of the handouts, most especially the problems that we will be using in the computations that we will be doing here. Okay, so expect two things that we will be um, uh, discussing in these videos. So we have theory discussions and then we also have problem discussions okay when you say theory the terminologies the concepts that you need to understand and then problems we will be doing some computations okay so i hope that uh, you will be with me until the end of this lesson and uh, again just a quick overview medyo maaga pa para subihin, but after we finish the part one then we proceed to part two okay so that's all and please like and subscribe for the latest video lessons. Again, this is Sir Chua. I am Kevin Troy Chua, your teacher for this specific subject. Goodbye and see you in the next video.